Mount Etna, towering over Sicily, Italy, holds a geological secret far more dramatic than its spectacular lava eruptions. Recent scientific data indicate that this volcanic giant is erupting and slowly sliding into the Mediterranean Sea. This phenomenon, driven largely by gravity, raises concerns about potential future hazards, particularly the threat of a catastrophic tsunami. Mount Etna's movement is not new, but recent years of research, particularly using modern geodetic technology, have provided a clearer and more alarming picture. From 2012 to 2025, the entire volcano reportedly moved an average of about 14 millimeters, about 0.6 inches per year in an east-southeast direction toward the coastal town of Jir. The most unstable part is Etna's southeastern flank. Satellite and GPS-based measurements have long observed this movement on the ground. A new study using a network of underwater acoustic measurements has demonstrated that this movement continues beneath the ocean's surface for the first time. Scientists recorded a slow slip event in 2017 inches which the underwater portion of the volcano's flank shifted by up to 4 centimeters in just 8 days. This shift occurred along a fault without any accompanying earthquakes, suggesting the movement was driven by gravitational instability. It does not appear to be caused by magma pressure within the volcano, but primarily by gravity pulling the entire mountain's mass downward. Etna sits on a weak, soft, sedimentary bed, allowing this slow movement known as volcanic spreading. Although Etna's current movement is slow on a human scale, geologists warn that this slow slip could someday translate into a rapid and catastrophic collapse. If the volcano's flank experiences a sudden and rapid acceleration, it could trigger a massive landslide. A large-scale collapse entering the sea could trigger a mega-tsunami in the Mediterranean Sea. This tsunami would seriously threaten millions of people living along the coasts of Sicily, Italy, and possibly the wider Mediterranean region. Currently, there are no indications that a major collapse is imminent and a movement of 14 millimeters per year is considered small. However, recent data showing underwater displacement highlights the need for close and continuous monitoring to detect signs of accelerating movement. Mount Etna remains one of the world's most fascinating and best studied volcanoes. This new data on underwater displacement adds another layer of complexity and urgency to its geological monitoring. As long as Etna continues to erupt and spread, scientists will closely monitor every millimeter of its movement looking for signs that this active giant will succumb to the pull of gravity and slide more rapidly into the sea, potentially triggering a disaster far greater than any eruption. Meanwhile, seismic monitoring of the Campi Flagre caldera allows us to better track the evolution of volcanism. We analyzed recent seismic data showing a sharp increase in seismicity in the densely populated Campi Flagre caldera.
Our analysis expanded the seismicity catalog from approximately 12,000 to over 54,000 earthquakes. The more complete seismic picture reveals a well-defined caldera ring fault system exhibiting a narrow seismic depth range. Shallow faults are clearly visible in the northern part of the caldera and reveal a very shallow hybrid earthquake source, likely related to the hydrothermal system. We have not observed direct signs of upward magma migration or seismic activity at depths below 3.7 kilometers. 